Hey guys, Ronnie Kreider here with Mobile Metals. Thanks for watching. Welcome back. Uh, it's been a while since I've done a video, but I've been promising you guys a, a video on the truck. That is Penny Polly. Uh, Penny Polly. Uh, it is a Greek name, and it stands for drinks a lot. Let me tell you, <laughs> she lives up to her name. Penny Polly is a F-350 Ford uh, V-10, 6.8 liter. It is the last year they made the V-10 pickup truck uh, for the Fords. Lariat, Super Duty, 365 horsepower, uh, 465 I believe it's 465 uh, foot pounds of torque so we have enough truck to haul the trailer that we that we're looking at getting so just a little view for you here open it up so you can see inside We were just truly blessed to, to stumble upon this, so I'm thankful for it. It is the Lariat, the heated seats, uh, it's got the sink my ride, all that stuff, so it's got the Bluetooth capabilities, four-wheel drive. I mean, so far, we've put about 1,500 miles on it. It's just a, a great truck. You can see we got plenty of room and back seat. Tons of space. Tons of room, and it is the long bed. So I believe when I measured this, it was 91 inches from the from the front to the to the back here. So we have plenty of storage when we do finally put the fifth wheel in it. Uh, but this is it, Penny Polly guys. Nice truck. I'll give you an idea of how big it is. This thing is huge. You got to climb up in it. Right now, I'm getting right now empty highway 11 and a half the most i've gotten is 12 miles a gallon so i imagine when we hook up the big jayco we're looking at i think it's about a 38 or 40 foot 355 jayco uh, we'll probably get an eight seven eight at best so but this is it So anyways, like I promised you guys, I won't drag it out because I know you don't want to just look at another boring truck. Uh, but in the truck video on buying the right truck, uh, some of the recommendations, something I want to remind you guys, if those gear ratios are not right in the rear end, it totally eliminates that truck from being able to do the job that you need it to do. So so check the rear end. See, uh, You can go online and download any of the PDFs. That's what I've done on all the trucks I looked at. I just went on whatever truck you're looking at go online download the pdf for that that make and model enough on the truck uh you guys might notice some of the the ice around me here i'll show you all of the trees are are covered with ice some of them are broken and snap we had a little bit of an ice storm come through but the roads never really got too bad roads for some reason never really got cold enough to, to ice over so we were lucky there but Anyway, I'm going to take the girls. I think there's a place in, in Eckert's that has ice skating. Stick around. Well, I walk all the way from me, say, Louis Town. Oh, and I hit the one more lousy down. Adriana is super excited, but I don't think Deanna is very keen on the whole idea, so. They're not talking me into putting on a pair of them things. 
I don't I don't heal as easily as I used to. So, okay, so here we are. So this is the Eckerd's ice skating rink. The girls are going to give it a shot. What do you think? Okay. You ready? No. Huh? Here, hold this. I'm leaning forward. Are you excited? Uh, I feel like I'm going to die. Do you know what size shoe you wear? Eight. So it's pretty cool. They got a place over here where we can rent, uh, not we, they can rent skates. Uh, I'll show you the skating rink here. It's not really big, but it's kind of cool for the kids. These two are a mess. <laughs> finishing up oh uh, a side note I just seen earlier uh, January 23rd for those of you that are from around here Eckert's has uh, for customer appreciation their pies here are delicious from the bakery but they're very expensive January 23rd they have buy one get one free so it looks like they're coming in off the ice they may have had enough they I think they want to take a break and get something to eat they give you a bracelet so you can come and go. That's kind of cool. Look at my hands. Your ankles are swelled up. Look at my thing. I fell on my stomach. I fell on my knees and I went on my stomach and my toes. We just got done with some ice skating. We was there about an hour and a half. We're going to take a break and get some lunch and... and go back but we, we need you guys help we don't know if if it's if it's more slippery or what's the we know slippery is the a word uh is slippery. it is it more slippery more slippery or it's I slippery or, or it's more slippery that synthetic ice is more slippery than regular ice or is it or is it that synthetic ice is slipperier. <laughs> Love the English. Hey, I'm all okay. for slipperier. But you guys leave a comment in the in the comment section below if you would and, and let us know. Am I just illiterate or what? We don't know what it is, so leave in the comments. Help us out. Thanks. <laughs> Well, here we are outside the skating rink. She's going to brave it again. I'm not using the thing anymore. I was so, going to do that thing. I wasn't going to film it until she said she wasn't going to use the thing anymore. And then I thought, I better get the camera for this one. So. Oh, I'll saw a million times. I already have. <laughs>
home. That was a fun day. Thanks for coming along, and if you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up, uh, like it, and subscribe, and share with your friends. Uh, don't forget the, the comment about uh, slippery or, or a slipperer. Or what was it? Synthetic ice is more slippery than real ice, or more slipperier than real ice? Yeah, it's slipperier, I think. <laughs> anyway, comment, let us know. See you guys. Buddy, what's up? Hey, Tommy. Come on, baby boy. What's up, buddy? What's up? I'm glad to see you, huh? Where are you going? Did you miss us? Come here, buddy. What's up, buddy, huh? Oh, goodness, huh? You're so excited. Well, we love you, too. We love you, too. Ha, 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 ha.